So last night, I had another really cool experience, and I feel that it had to do with actually a video that I made probably like four or so weeks ago. This was a video talking about how when we really ground ourselves in the present moment, and we realize that we can do anything that we want to, we can be anybody that we want to, we can be however we want to, it's the magic of the present moment, right? The present moment is unknown, and therefore, because it's unknown, you can do anything that you want to, especially when you step outside of the mind, right? I've spent a lot of my life overthinking, and last night was the exact opposite of that. Um, I was at an open mic night that I normally go to in the, uh, the town here, and there was... A group of musicians playing uh, guitar, drums, and bass, and the guitarist was trying to play a song from one of my favorite bands, actually. And I noticed that the drummer was like struggling to like catch on and like play the beat and everything. And so I didn't think about it, and I was like, "Are you trying to play this song by that band?" And they were like, "Yeah." And I was like, give me the sticks. <laughs> and so I played it. I played the, the, uh, the, the drum part. And what's interesting is that that's probably something that the old self of me would have, uh, not, would have been challenged by and would have struggled to do. However, last night, I wasn't tuned into everyone else's energy and everyone else's you know, emotions and stuff. I wasn't worried about what everyone else thought about me. All that I was worried about, it's not even that I was worried about anything. All that I was focused on was being present and enjoying myself and having a fun time. And I was able to play that song and I continued to play other songs. Um, and then I actually got up from the drums and I started just kind of like playing the guitar a little bit not any like specific notes, just like making sounds with it. And then I actually went over to the bass guitar and two of my other friends came out and one of them took the guitar and the other one took the drums. And then I was just playing the bass, an instrument that I don't think I've ever played before. And if I have played before, it was like once. I don't really know a lot about how it works, but I do understand music theory. And so we were just jamming, and I was so in the moment. I wasn't worried about what everyone else was thinking, you know? Previously in life, the way that it would work was that I would worry about what everyone else is thinking. And it's interesting because that has a lot to do with learning to tune your energy outside of yourself, to tune into everyone else, to achieve a sense of safety, right? It's like, oh, what are they thinking about me? Oh, what are they thinking about me, right? That whole kind of thing. And I just didn't do that last night. I actually brought my energy back to myself and into my body, and I just enjoyed myself. And it was such a stellar experience, too, because, like, I realized that the more that I tune myself back into myself and not worry so much about what everyone else might be thinking... I'm actually doing better at what it is that I'm doing in that moment. So like playing the drums last night, um, just messing around on the guitar, playing the bass. Like when I was playing the bass, I was able to like understand what it was that I, need, that I needed to play, like which notes and everything, because understanding music theory, you know scales and all that stuff and what sounds right, what doesn't sound right. So I was able to do that. And I was just so in the moment. And that in and of itself, that energy dynamic, is exactly what I am intending to create more of in my life moving forward. And so last night was one of those examples of just going with the flow and being in the moment and not worrying about... I, I, you know, I, I really think that um, that's the magic of life, you know? I was watching a video by um, Eckhart Tolle last night on manifestation and how it works and like, like what it really means and everything. And it's all about feeling the fullness of life in the present moment, right? So um, 
he referenced about how uh, Jesus would talk about, um, you know, in terms of prayer, like when you pray, right? Be as if what it is that you're praying for, you already have. And that's the power of the present moment. That's the power of the fullness of life and elevated emotions. And so, like, like last night, I was just focused on being present and enjoying myself and having a fun time. If I messed up, cool. And I'm pretty sure that I did. And it was fun. And I don't think anyone noticed. And that's fine. And that's great. And it's just, like, allowing myself to enjoy that entire process is what's so cool about this whole thing, you know? And I really did. I just, I stepped into the moment. I stepped into my power. I stepped into the present moment. And, you know, it, it's, it's so fascinating because my life now is drastically different from what it used to be when I was younger. And I would argue to be probably the biggest change is me tuning my energy back into myself and into my body and not focusing on what everyone else might be thinking. Not only because it, you know, to a much larger extent, it doesn't really matter. You know, there, 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 there are, there are times and situations when worrying about what other people think matters. And I agree with that and I understand that, but to a very large extent, right? I believe that I'm just meant to enjoy myself and my experiences of life and just flow and understand that spontaneous opportunities are going to arise and present themselves. And I feel like last night was one of those moments where the universe was like, here, have fun, right? And I just went for the ride. I did. And I think that that is the magic of life and that is also available in every moment of life i really do it, it's it's fascinating because i think that that what i just said right there that it's available in every moment of life is something that i've wanted to believe for a long time and also a uh, an idea and insight that i've been trying to conclude to for a long time but I've also been waiting for specific moments and experiences and opportunities like last night to really have a good time with life. But every single moment of life holds that same magic. And I just think that that's the way that life works. I don't know. I could be wrong. But I have fun whenever these opportunities present themselves. And I think that if I allow myself to see every moment of life as one of those opportunities to just experience the magic and enjoy myself. I think I'll start to find life consistently even more fulfilling, and I'm very excited for that.